Which fruit will probably disappear from grocery stores? It's bananas. Almost every banana you eat today is a single variety. The Cavendish. Bananas don't grow from seeds the way apples or oranges do. They're cloned from cuttings. That makes farming simple and consistent. You always get the same size, the same taste, and the same shelf life. And it allowed for the banana to become the world's most consumed fruit after the tomato. But the downside is that there is no genetic diversity. And when plants are genetically identical, one single disease can wipe out everything. And that's already happened once. In the 1950s, a fungus destroyed the previous global banana at that time, the Gros Michel. Cavendish replaced it because it was resistant to that fungus at that time. But now there's a new fungus called Tropical Race 4, spreading across Asia, Africa, and Latin America. Once it infects the soil, it stays deadly for decades. Cavendish could go the same way as the Gros Michel. The good news? Researchers are racing to develop disease-resistant hybrids, white banana varieties, and even CRISPR gene-edited bananas. The future might not be Cavendish, but you might have a supermarket shelf filled with different bananas, each with unique flavors and colors.